Hello, everybody, and welcome once again to Florida Tech. It's actually the College Tour's second time visiting this amazing private research university where students from all over the world come to make history and shape the future. We couldn't be more excited to be back on this beautiful campus located in sunny Melbourne, Florida. It's a small but dynamic community known for its beautiful beaches, close proximity to NASA's Kennedy Space Center, and buzzing innovation economy. Think of it as part paradise, part training ground for dream jobs. I'm your host, Alex Boylan, and over the next half hour, we're gonna explore this campus and meet real undergrad and grad students who are pursuing their passions right here every day. Florida Tech students are some of the most driven, determined, and talented people you're ever gonna meet. And their stories are absolutely incredible. Welcome once again to Florida Tech. This is the College Tour. Let's meet Lauren Ann, a young alum and current grad student who used her degree in aerospace engineering to launch a career at NASA. If there's anything Florida Tech is known for, it's helping ambitious students gain the skills and knowledge needed to become extremely employable professionals. Success comes in many forms, and Florida Tech graduates exemplify them all. Let's hear your story. Three, two, one. Thank you, Alex. I'm a recent aerospace engineering grad and a current mechanical engineering master's student at Florida Tech. Since the age of five, it has been my dream to be an astronaut, which is what brought me here to sunny Melbourne, Florida. Florida Tech got my attention with its unique and inspiring history, diverse but intimate community, and tropical location on Florida's space coast. As it turns out, I couldn't have picked a more perfect school for me. The opportunities here are incredible. As an undergrad, my Florida Tech education helped me to land an amazing internship working with the science and engineering teams at NASA's Kennedy Space Center, twice, which then led to my first job. Today, I'm proud to be a test engineer on NASA's Artemis program, working on the Orion spacecraft fleet that will take humans back to the moon. If this university is known for anything, it's preparing students for the jobs of tomorrow. Florida Tech alumni are literally out of this world. They're astronauts, scientists, engineers, educators, CEOs, and award-winning leaders in all kinds of industries all over the world. Companies like Northrop Grumman, Lockheed Martin, L3 Harris, Embraer, and more are located close to campus and home to many of our Florida Tech alumni. Florida Tech has been my home away from home ever since the first time a professor let me and a few of my friends leave class for a few minutes to see a rocket launch. Hopefully one day, I'll be walking on the moon. But until then, I'll continue to passionately work towards my dreams. The incredible people who have come into my life because of my time here taught me that the sky is definitely not the limit. It's only the beginning. Back to you, Alex. Roger that, ground control. Lauren Ann, from student to intern to NASA test engineer, it sounds like Florida Tech's long-standing tradition of preparing students for amazing careers of the future is strong and thriving. What an out-of-this-world start to your journey towards becoming an astronaut. So inspiring, thank you. Let's hear from Darren, a senior ocean engineering major and sustainability minor from Worcester, Massachusetts, who's gonna tell you about diving into his classes and preparing for senior design, Florida Tech's signature capstone engineering experience. Darren's got an amazing Florida Tech story, which actually began before he was even born. But let's let him tell that. Take it away. Thanks, Alex. I've always had close ties to Florida Tech. Both my parents are alumni who not only met on campus, but got married on top of the Crawford Building. So when I knew that I wanted to study renewable energy and ocean engineering, I knew Florida Tech was perfect for me too. From day one, I began getting hands-on experience. In my Intro to Ocean Engineering course, 
we were assigned a project that had us form teams to design, build, and race prototype boats in the campus pool. At Florida Tech, this is just how it works. If you're an engineering student, you take courses in your major and participate in exciting projects starting your first year. And it only gets better from there. I've gone to attend the Young Coastal Scientists and Engineers Conference, as well as participate in a three-day research cruise across the Florida Keys. These immersive experiences have helped me to gain valuable practical experience in my field. Now my Florida Tech engineering experience is culminating in something we call senior design. In senior design, we form teams to engineer working solutions to real world problems. My team and I have designed and built a shoreline wave energy converter that operates on a magnetic induction coil. In other words, a machine that converts wave energy into electric power. We develop projects like this in our student design center, the Panther Works, before we present them at the annual Northrop Grumman Engineering and Science Student Design Showcase, where industry professionals will observe and judge our work. As a senior, I'm often thinking about what's next, but whether I decide to further my education or pursue my first job as an engineer, I know that the experience I've gained here at Florida Tech has prepared me for success. Alex, back to you. Thank you, Darren. I love that you love the university where your parents fell in love, especially since you're having such a great experience working alongside other Florida Tech students on a senior design project that means something to you. You're a great ambassador for engineering at Florida Tech. Awesome job, Darren. It's now my great pleasure to introduce you to Nishida, who came to Florida Tech from the other side of the world to study astrobiology and she stayed to get both her master's and PhD in biomedical engineering. If anybody knows about science and research at Florida Tech, it's her. What's up, Nishida? Thank you, Alex. From the bustling streets of Mumbai, India to the vibrant campus of Florida Tech, my journey has been nothing short of extraordinary. With a deep love of space and a strong interest in life sciences, I wanted to pursue a major that would merge the two. So I found my fit in the astrobiology program at Florida Tech. Towards the completion of my degree, I sought a more hands-on research experience, so I stayed to pursue a master's degree. Now I'm towards the completion of my PhD in biomedical engineering. Every science lab feels like a sanctuary to me. Surrounded by cutting edge equipment, I get to immerse myself in the fascinating world of biomedical research. It is in spaces like this that I've had the privilege of working with professors like Dr. Kishore, a guiding light whose mentorship has propelled me forward in my field. My research focuses on ACL reconstruction applications, a subject that holds personal significance in my life as someone who has undergone three ACL reconstructions. Through this work, I hope to make a difference in the lives of those facing similar challenges. Florida Tech is full of people like me, people who are passionate about improving the world through science and research. Students here are pursuing potential treatments for neurodegenerative diseases, developing methods for sustaining life on Mars, designing innovative cybersecurity technologies, and finding new ways to address coral reef decline. Florida Tech is more than just a university. It is a community of people who truly care about every student's success. Having the unwavering support of professors, staff, and even my peers has made this experience truly extraordinary and set me on a trajectory to make a difference in the world. Now back to you, Alex. Making a meaningful difference. Wow, Nishida, thank you so much. We can definitely see why you picked Florida Tech for your bachelor's degree and why you chose to stay for your master's and doctorate. So many eye-opening scientific research opportunities. It's simply awesome. Best of luck in your future, Nishida, and thanks again. Okay, everyone, let's take a moment to meet Marcello and talk student life. An international student who came to Florida Tech from Venezuela Marcello can tell you about almost every aspect of student life at Florida Tech because he's pretty much done all of it. You might even call him the king of getting involved. It's all you, Marcello. Yep, that's me. Thanks, Alex. 
I came to Florida Tech from my home country, Venezuela. I've always been a huge people person, so coming here, I knew I had to find ways of getting involved in my community. Thankfully, Florida Tech Student Life offers abundant ways of doing just that. Whether it's through joining one of our 100 plus clubs, attending events, participating in activities, or gaming in our awesome eSports Center. Here, you can play just for fun or join one of our competitive junior varsity or varsity teams. I got my start by joining the Latin American Student Association, where I met others who enjoyed my culture and I even learned how to dance. We choreographed a routine for Florida Tech's annual international festival and performed it in front of everyone. Soon, I had all these incredibly diverse friends who were also super involved. Over time, I wanted to do more and more. I became an orientation leader because I wanted to help show new students what we love so much about our university. And because I enjoy living on campus, I also applied to become a resident assistant. In this role, I got to put fun events together such as barbecues, game nights, and even haunted houses. And of course, I met a ton of amazing people. We take classes together, participate in clubs together, and of course, we eat together. One of my favorite places on campus has to be the Panther Dining Hall, where my friends and I enjoy meals together as much as possible. The food is great, and the staff is always ready to greet you and feed you with a smile. I made a ton of friends. I became a resident director, and I even got to be homecoming king. But most importantly, I learned that every student has the power to bring something positive into other students' lives. Am I right about that, Alex? Totally right, Marcello. Students getting involved so they can make life better for other students. What a great message. And wow, it sounds like there's a way for every student at Florida Tech to make their experience special. Marcello, thank you for bringing us into your world and showing us what it means to get involved. Great job. Attention passengers, this is your captain speaking. It's time to hear from senior aviation management major and fan of everything that flies, Zach, who hails all the way from Worcester, Ohio. We'll meet Zach over at the university's flight line, located just down the road at the Melbourne Orlando International Airport. Time for takeoff, Zach. You got the controls. Hey everyone. I discovered my love for aviation when I was just four years old, the day my grandparents took me to my first ever air show. Ever since, I've had my eyes on the sky. I came to Florida Tech to build a career out of my greatest passion, and I'm not alone. Students who want to become pilots come from all over the world to study at Florida Tech. Here, they can start flying their first semester on campus, learning from top instructors, and preparing for a future job with one of Florida Tech's partner airlines well before graduation. Of course, the College of Aeronautics is more than flight training. It offers programs designed to prepare students for successful careers in many aspects of the global aviation industry such as aviation science, human factors, meteorology, safety, air traffic control, and my personal favorite, aviation management. Being a student in Florida Tech's College of Aeronautics means learning from professors who are accomplished industry experts. My professors are pilots, air traffic controllers, planners, managers, and consultants. Plus, you're always learning from students as equally passionate and driven as you are. Outside of class, I lead Collegiate Aviation Business Executives, or CABE, one of many active student organizations on campus. With the support of my department and many enthusiastic alumni, I'm able to travel across the country with CABE to attend airport tours and professional conferences, where we explore our career possibilities side by side with some of aviation's greatest leaders. Most recently, I've had the opportunity to explore and jumpstart my career by completing an internship at the nearby Melbourne Orlando International Airport. So Florida Tech has not only given me a foundational knowledge in aviation management, they've given me an insight into my career that will help me pave my own path forward. That's it for now, back to you, Alex. Good job, Zach, and thanks so much for the behind the scenes look at Florida Tech's Flight Training Center, as well as the Melbourne Orlando International Airport. Your internship there, working alongside experienced airport managers and aviation professionals must have been so awesome. Keep up the great work, Zach. Let's meet Sienna. 
an ocean engineering major from Gulfport, Mississippi, who started her Florida Tech experience as a transfer student. Now a senior, getting ready to graduate, Sienna's story is about the extreme sense of warmth you will feel as a Florida Tech student. And no, she's not talking about the weather. It's all about the people. Over to you, Sienna. Thanks, Alex. Hey, y'all. When I first came to Florida Tech to do my campus tour, I instantly felt like I was a part of the campus community. Every person I met that day, from the admission counselors to the professors, gave me such a warm welcome that I left my tour feeling like Florida Tech was home. Later, as an incoming transfer student, I was worried that making friends would be tough, but with each class and every meal I ate at the Panther Dining Hall, I built new friendships. My classmates, more quickly than expected, became an important part of my life. We share birthdays together and spend holidays when home is a little too far away. We laugh together, support one another, and are always there to celebrate each other's wins. As a member of the Panther Media Group, I feel at home every time I enter the studio to hang out with my friends. I feel at home every time I go into the library and see my classmates working on projects. I even look forward to saying hi to Oscar the trolley driver, as well as our campus dining staff every day. There's such a strong community and a warm welcoming culture here that finding a sense of belonging is effortless. Even though Florida Tech is a relatively small university, it is big in character. Students from all over the world attend Florida Tech, which creates an open and dynamic atmosphere, but familiar and comfortable. Wherever you look, there's a friendly face. At Florida Tech, I've learned the importance and beauty of community. With the help of my professors and peers, I've been able to be successful both in and outside the classroom. This is truly my home away from home. Now back to you, Alex. Thank you, Sienna, for sharing your story and your heart with us today. I've got to tell you, the first time I visited Florida Tech, I felt that sense of community you've just described. And now that I'm back, it's even stronger. This is a special campus filled with amazing people, Sienna, and you are one of them. Thank you so much. Let's catch up with Josie Ann from Fairport, New York, who's going to introduce us to life as a student in Florida Tech's College of Psychology and Liberal Arts. If you're interested in human creativity, human behavior, and the human condition, you're going to want to pay close attention to this one. Josie Ann, we can't wait to hear from you. Please take it away. Well, Alex, I actually started my college experience at a different school with a different major, and neither turned out right for me. I needed adventure, so I visited Florida Tech while vacationing in the area. Within a week of my amazing campus visit, I committed to the university and both the Panther volleyball and track teams. I've always had a creative side and thought it might be time to turn my photography hobby into a career. So I decided to major in multi-platform journalism. This program covers every area of media production, including video, writing, photography, audio, and graphic design. Perfect. Once I decided my major, my academic advisor introduced me to several opportunities to gain experience on campus. As a result, I became the editor-in-chief of the Crimson, Florida Tech's student-run newspaper. I've also photographed and created content for Florida Tech Athletics, produced podcasts for Panther Radio, and developed my own photography business. I see all my friends and classmates in the College of Psychology and Liberal Arts enjoying experiences like these. Whether they're majoring in communications, humanities, pre-law, psychology, forensic psychology, or behavior analysis, they're all gaining real world experiences on and off campus. Music, media, research, community service, athletics, we do it all. My experience as both an athlete and a multi-platform journalism major at Florida Tech has really shown me what direction I want to take in life. After graduation, I plan to pursue a career in sports media. I'm beyond grateful that Florida Tech enabled me to combine my two passions in life, sports and creativity. I bet you can relate, Alex. I can totally relate, Josie Ann. 
Turning my passions into a profession is actually how the college tour came to be. I love helping students like you find their fit at amazing universities like Florida Tech. Josiane, thank you so much for joining us and congratulations on the Editor-in-Chief gig. You're gonna be great. Go Panthers! Two words that mean a lot to everyone at Florida Tech, especially its NCAA Division II athletes. Take Carter, for example, a sophomore aerospace engineering student from Kalamazoo, Michigan. Carter also plays for the men's lacrosse team. It's a rigorous combination to be sure, but in true scholar athlete fashion, Carter's making it happen. Tell us more, Carter. Thanks, Alex. Hey everyone, it was always my dream to play collegiate lacrosse. And from a young age, I always knew I wanted to study aerospace engineering. I realized that dream could become reality when I discovered Florida Tech. Here, I'm able to learn and play lacrosse, both at a high level. When you're in the Sunshine State Conference, no matter what sport you play, you're gonna be going up against some of the best competition the NCAA Division II has to offer. Pair that with some of the best academics in the state of Florida, and you've got the perfect environment for both success in the classroom and on the field. Being a scholar athlete at Florida Tech is extremely rewarding. You're instantly part of a group of students who are all here for the same reason, to win championships and to earn a top tier degree. It is the perfect culture to excel in both academics and athletics. Plus, heading to practice at 7 a.m. and watching a rocket launch between drills is something very few other collegiate athletes can say they have done. Playing a collegiate sport teaches you many useful skills that can then be applied to your academics, and few other universities do it like Florida Tech. I thought it would be difficult to manage a major in aerospace engineering while also playing a collegiate sport, but that hasn't been the case. As long as you stay on top of your work and rely on the support of your friends, teammates, faculty, coaches and staff, you'll have no problem making it work. Take it from me, I even had enough time to be in a TV show. Right, Alex? Right, Carter, and let me just say, you are killing it. Your dedication to your studies and your team is outstanding. And it's clear how much the support of your teammates, coaches, and professors means to you. Thanks for reminding every future Panther that rigorous academics and competitive athletics go hand in hand. It's time to talk business. And for that, we need Jared, a junior business administration major from Williamsburg, West Virginia. Jared's one of those students who has a clear vision of his future and understands exactly how his Florida Tech business degree will help him get there. So you're gonna to wanna to listen to this one very closely. Over to you, Jared. Thanks, Alex. Hey everyone, during my college search, I looked for a place that provided excellent academics and close connections with professors. I wanted a university where I felt like a person and not a number. And on top of that, it had to have a great business school. That's why I chose Florida Tech. Since my first day at Florida Tech, I've been immersed in courses from accounting and economics to marketing and management that have helped me build a great foundation in business and to gain valuable career experience. I've always been fascinated with the theme park business, and this past summer, I got to intern over at Universal Orlando Resort, which is just one hour away from campus. There, I felt like I was truly able to offer actionable value to my team because of the skills and knowledge I gained at Florida Tech. Florida Tech's commitment to practical learning is embodied by its business faculty who bring a wide range of industry expertise into every classroom. These professors coach students in preparation for activities like case competitions where we got professional experience pitching ideas to real business leaders. My professors have always been outstanding mentors, supporting me in my chosen field of study and offering crucial support as I work towards my goals. I've also learned a lot from my friends and classmates. The collaborative international environment at Florida Tech has introduced me to customs and perceptions from all over the world helping me to develop essential skills that I know will help me in my career. How do I know I've gotten a great education at Florida Tech? I feel 100% prepared for what comes next. What can be better than that? Am I right, Alex?
Definitely, Jared. The only thing better than feeling prepared is being prepared. And it sounds like you're going to graduate with a ton of both competence and confidence. We wish you all the success in the world, Jared, and are sure your Florida Tech business education will help you achieve it. Nice job. Okay, everyone, let's head over to the Gleason Performing Arts Center to hear from Emma, a senior who embodies the idea that whatever you want to do, you can make it happen at Florida Tech. She's taken all of her interests, computers, space, literature, music, and theater, and turned them into an absolutely extraordinary educational experience. Folks, meet the amazing Emma. Thank you, Alex. I discovered a variety of interests at a young age. Aerospace engineering, a direct result of space camp, computer science, literature, and theater. So when I was looking for a university, I had a very long and specific checklist. But Florida Tech checked every box for me. Now I'm in aerospace engineering and computer science double major with a minor in literature. I have a singing scholarship through Florida Tech's music program, and I'm entering my second year as the president of College Players, the student-led theater group. During my time here, I've had a blast producing, performing, and directing a variety of shows. It's awesome that so many STEM-minded students like me have a place to express their passion for the arts. Florida Tech truly empowers students to pursue both personal and academic interests. In the same day, I can go from academic research with one of my faculty mentors to building personal connections with our amazing alumni through my job at the Office of Advancement to rehearsing for a musical in the company of my talented friends. A big part of every semester is figuring out how to balance everything, but my professors and advisors have always supported my interests and helped me to be successful. I'm not the only student with this experience either. I know many other students who want to do it all at Florida Tech. And for students like us, having the support of faculty and staff truly makes all the difference. It's always exciting to find new opportunities to learn, make new friends, and prepare for the future. I'm excited to see what my final years at Florida Tech have in store. That's all from me, Alex. Take it away. Simply inspiring, Emma, wow. I already knew that Florida Tech encourages students to reach for the stars, but I didn't know that meant you could reach for so many stars at once. Your dedication and drive are truly admirable. Emma, I am right there with you. I can't wait to see what your future holds. How much do you love Florida Tech and our 10 amazing tour guides? I love being back on campus and seeing how much it's changed. But what's really special? is what stayed the same. Your rich history, welcoming community, culture of innovation, the opportunities, and of course, incredible students. The best thing you can do is schedule your own campus visit here. The second best? Watch Florida Tech's first time on the college tour. Season one, episode two, you're gonna love it. But don't go just yet. This week, I had the pleasure to spend some time with the president of Florida Tech. I asked him a question, so stay tuned for the credits to watch that. And we'll see you on campus real soon, everyone. Take care. So what's the one thing that differentiates Florida Tech from other universities? Fundamentally, Alex, it's our STEM-focused education. 65 years strong now, but it's more than that. It's serving our students. We launch our students into great careers in science, technology, engineering, and so much more. I don't think any other university quite has the same pedigree. And you see that in our motto, ad astra for scientium, to the stars through science. And it's so true, and you see that with every single one of your students. Indeed you do.